Oh, this crowd, as we've come to expect in recent years, as loud as any in the NFL, and they get even louder when their Seahawks are introduced. We're ready for football as the Seahawks get set to do battle with the San Francisco 49ers. Here's the Seahawks' new signee, Blair Walsh, to get us started as we are underway from Seattle. Set to return, here's Raheem Moster. And nice work on the return as they'll start their drive just past the 30-yard line. Here's Hoyer. Oh, he's going to air it out right away. And it's knocked away and incomplete. The intended receiver, Marquise Goodwin. And that'll bring up second down. We talk all the time about playmakers on offense, but let's face it, there are plenty of playmakers on defense, too. I think we just saw an example of one, didn't we? Not forced that incompletion. Yeah, he's a great corner. They got a couple of them on that side of the football. Hoyer. And the Seahawks defense gets to him, and they bring him down. The game plan for any defense is finding ways to make a quarterback uncomfortable in the pocket. When you bring pressure from all angles, you never know who's going to get home. In this case, the left cornerback right in the face of him puts him down. And I don't think this is the script they had in mind for their opening drive. This is third and long. Let's go. Now Hoyer. The 21 yards there as they convert on third. The general consensus that Brian Hoyer was acquired by San Francisco to be a one-year solution at quarterback. I know Brian, he looks at it as a long-term solution. He wants to complete passes like that and say, I'm no stopgap, I'm here to stay, right? Got his target, Pierre Garçon. And he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. 23 yards on the play. They'll look to throw now on first down. And that is caught. Oh, what a catch at the five-yard line. He got 29 yards that time. And he's already got two catches on the opening drive. <laughs> they know he's going to be a handful. And sometimes you game plan for that offensively. You want to make sure that guy touches the ball, and sometimes it just happens. And he hauls it in in the end zone. Touchdown, San Francisco. Marquise Goodwin, a five-yard touchdown. And the 49ers drive right down the field and score on the opening drive. And there's going to be a stoppage here. The booth wants to take another look at this potential touchdown. Robbie Gold on for the extra point. And the 49ers grab a 7 to nothing lead. The putter pinion now to kick this one away. This is taken about seven yards deep. And he'll get it up to about the 26-yard line just across the 25. The Seattle now ready to march out of the field. Shoulder pads took him right off his feet, right around the 31. Now, Charles, what's the mindset here offensively? You gave up the touchdown pretty quickly. Would it have changed if you had gotten a stop and it would be 0-0 right now or no? I wouldn't think so. I think in most cases, just down a touchdown, you know, I mean, we're just getting started here. It should be a long way to go. And no escaping this time as he'll go down. They got him for a sack. Take care of Dean. 
In there to bury him for a loss of 11. Well, the beauty of screen passes is they take a little time to develop and they can often hit big, but sometimes they take too long to develop and sometimes you get sacked. Yeah, what's perfectly called for a defense to attack a screen? Typically a blitz. And even though people think that the screen operates against the blitz, if you have the blitz called and you still cover the screen, now that allows your blitzers to get there. And he's got Lockett. And he's going to have a first down as he's brought down at the 44-yard line. 23 yards on the play. I know at the end of games, coaches always tell us that no one play won or lost a game. But this seems pretty important early.